I have to pay tribute to a very dear friend and um, it's a life that one cannot relate or narrate in two minutes. Actually, we need a whole book to do so. But I've kind of put something together, truncated it, so at least to give you an idea of who he was and what he meant to us. You know, I never dreamed that one day I would be standing and speaking in front of a congregation speaking about Guangwa the way I'm going to speak about him now. Two years back, unfortunately, I was also one among many mourners who came to Hugh Masekela's funeral to bid him farewell. Before that, Jonas, Hugh Masekela, and myself sang the song Hush at Miriam Makeba's funeral. Another year, I was at Aus Dorothy's funeral. Another one, Sis Tandi Mbambani, Tandi class. And I keep watching all these people that I grew up with in this business as each and every one of them departs. That's why I say today is a spiritually complicated day for me because in my own mind I ask the question, why? Why had they left this world so soon when there is still so much for us to do here in this beloved country of ours. We gather to pay our respects to celebrate and bury a great artist and musician of the people, Prajay G. We have come to give an appropriate send off in spite of COVID limitations, to say farewell to a jewel to a national treasure, one of royal blood who chose to forego the salutes that go with that in order to carry the trombone as a weapon of choice, a weapon that oozed divine sounds. Brajeji, as he was popularly known among the many people around him, was a people's hero. As a person, he seemed to prefer saying less when you encountered him for the first time until he opened his mouth, always somewhat reluctantly. But his humor, as Brakaifa Semenya has just said, could leave you flawed while he continued giggling innocently with a naughty smile over what he had said. He was a real cold assassin when delivering his hilarious anecdotes, which were always written not for public consumption, for your ears only. Like his companions, Hugh Masekela and Brakefa Semenya, Comrade J.G. was an agent of the spirituality of our people. His love for freedom was genuine and deep. Today we're here to bid farewell to a life well lived. That De Jonas was not just a musician, but was an activist in his own right. A jazz maestro celebrated within the country and throughout the globe. As we come here today to mourn his passing, we also ask that we may celebrate the life that he has lived. That the Guangwa will be gone, but never forgotten. Because through his music, he will live on forever. 
in the hearts and minds of all of humanity. And for those of us who were privileged enough to have met him, his warm personality, quick wit and great sense of humor will linger on with the notes of his trombone. Hambagathe, Kawele Sizu. Hambagathe, Nkondo Sizu.